Big G Baby, and welcome back to Let's Play Mystic Arc! Last time, we got the Water Arc, and I decided to make my way back to Kumu Village in Giant's World off-screen because, well, we got a little dungeon here that we can go through. Now that we have the Water Arc, we can actually do what we need to do here. Now, in this area, though, the walls in the middle of the place are invisible, and so are the stairs. In fact, if you can actually see the stairs, chances are that's not where they actually go. So you just gotta kind of feel around for wherever the invisible walls are. You don't actually have to go through this area right now, but I think it's a good idea because you'd have to do a lot more backtracking by the time you have to actually come here to progress plot. Okay, so we got that, and... Okay, stairs are in the lower right. Fortunately, I have a map to make getting through this area a lot easier. Now, to get what for what we... Or to get what we really came here for, we got this little machine up here for some reason. I'm not sure what it does. Okay, well, we did get the wind going in this place, but now, in order to get that glass sphere out of there, we need to have the water arc. I'm not sure how that helps, but it does. Did it break? Hey, all right. Okay, so one more chest to get here, and then we're done. Okay, good. Made it back into my menu, and yeah, let's get out of here now. The thing is, is that with the next world we're going to go to, we will eventually need to get... Oh, you know, I can just rest up here. But yeah, we are eventually going to need to get that glass sphere, but it's a bit of a walk to get to the next world, so I want to minimize the number of trips that we have to go back and forth to that world. So I figure, hey, we've got the tools, we can get the job done, so we might as well just do it when it's convenient for us right now. By the way, the water arc has two effects when you put it into an item. If you put it into a figurine, they'll regenerate one HP per minute of game time, I think. So that's pretty useless. And if you put it into a piece of armor, it'll increase your ice resistance by 20 which is also not that extraordinary. So I generally don't use the water arc too much, other than like mandatory plot progression. I'm working on it. Well, let's see if we can't find a way to get in or where the next world is. Fireplace is more useful than the goddess. What do you mean you get tired? You're a fireplace! Hmm. Can I use the water arc on it? No. No, the water arc does not work on the fireplace. But, if you go over here... Well, let's see what we got. You can't just use a regular empty bottle. You have to actually use this one. So just fill it up there. Boom, we got our bottle of water. Unfortunately, it is not going to turn into an empty bottle when we're done with it. Although, not that we really need any more empty bottles, but they are there. Okay, so let's see, what do we got? There it is. Okay, so... What did that do? It reveals a secret passage! Ha ha! Why they have this huge cave behind a fireplace, I don't know. I would think all the heat from the fireplace would go out or something. Wouldn't stay in the house. But alright, let's see. So we got this little building here. And let's see what we got. Is it the villain's diary? Let's check it out. Not Okay, yeah. So in order to read a book, you need the wisdom arc. 
Let's see if that one has any clues for what we need to do. Or it could be the gate to the next world. Hey, hey all right. Now let's see where the plot's going to take us now. Seems like things are getting really serious now. <laughs> What do you mean, wolf? What are you talking about? What wolf? Hmm. Oh. A couple houses have been destroyed around here, huh? Well, it looks like the house on the right there had some bricks in it. Hmm. I wonder if that's the wolf that other person at the house was talking about. Yeah, most houses, they won't let you inside, but the item shop will. So let's see what they got here, wherever we are. Let's see, I need to buy, yeah, a few herbs. Not that I actually need them for, what is it, actually healing, but I need some items to do some item synthesis because we're going to be doing some in the very near future. So yeah, three salads and a liquid that ought to take care of business. Nothing else I really care to get there. Hey, how's it going? Who are you talking about? Ah. Well, good for you, I guess. Hmm. I wonder whose house this is. Well, they won't tell us. Oh, who lives in that house? Hmm, remember that for later. Oh, okay. I wasn't going to sell anything to you. But alright, we got the final equipment chops in the game, so let's see what we can get here. Alright, so let's see. Mithril armors, we want to get a couple of those. And I will be using Tokyo coming up here, as well as Kamawu. And let's see, we need new armor there for Lux. I will be using him in an upcoming dungeon. And let's see, the Royal Crowns, what do we got? Okay, yeah, let's... Hold on a sec. I don't want to get rid of the uh, Gobsmith. We still need some help with that, so let's see. Okay, so you got the Silver Helmet. And, okay, yeah, let's get rid of those, and we'll just swap for the new pieces of armor. The royal crowns there. Yeah, we still want the elemental resistances coming up here from the gobsmet and the worm met and all that stuff. And I think that's it that we can buy here. Was there anything else? Let's see, we could buy another thorn robe for Miriam, but we're going to get another one in the near future. And I don't want to buy that for Reshine because it doesn't have as good elemental resistances as her existing armor. And we're going to get something that she can use soon anyway. So, yeah, why worry about it? But all right, we got some pretty good weapons here. Let's see, we already got that. Let's see, that's as good as what we got already. Man, none of these weapons are that, well, most of them aren't that great. But I do want to buy, or, yeah, I do want to buy flame swords. Make sure you uh, infuse the arcs into the appropriate swords. In this case, I want to infuse the light arc into Tokyo's weapon, so that way he can deal more damage with his illusion strike there. Well, let's see what we got at the center of town. I don't need to rest up here, but it would be nice to get the save point, or the warp point. Well, there are a couple white trees out here. Hmm. Well, maybe I should check that out. How's it going? Oh, well, thank you. I don't need to rest up, but yeah, let's at least save while we're here. So we can figure out what to do. Or how to get back here eventually. Hey, how's it going? Oh, really? Yeah, I can kind of see... Something on the walls there. 
Hmm. You know, I'd say that that's strange, but I've been to Fruit World already. What is it with people eating buildings in these in, in this game? But alright, let's see. Well, we got one tree over here, and if you use the arc of wood on it, we get an item for our trouble. Sandwich? Huh. I was thinking there was going to be candy there, but I'll take what I can get. Now that item you actually have to get in order to progress with the plot. So don't use it. Don't sell it. I mean, you could just get another one, but... Well, you know what I mean. And here we get a poison apple. And actually, you could do that over and over and over again infinitely to get more poison apples. And it's a base material for crafting or synthesizing some items, and you could get like a ton of intelligence seeds out of it. I'm not gonna do that. I mean, I will use the one we got, but I'm not going to use them infinitely. Hmm, I wonder whose grandma that is there. Hmm. Well, let's see what we got here. Well, I don't see it, but I'll take your word for it. You could climb up there, but there's nothing there right now, so we'll save it for later. But I do want to cut down the beanstalk to get the troll harp. Another item that can be used in item synthesis here. Okay, how's it going? Ah, okay, uh, that's... Okay, well, I think we've been just about everywhere. I guess everyone's afraid of that wolf or something. I don't know what they're talking about, but... Okay. I know that laugh. What are you doing here? Oh, um, thanks, I guess. It is? It is, pretty much. You know, back at that house there, someone was asking me, H.C. Bailey, why would Darkness have just let you take the water arc instead of taking it for himself? And I don't know. My guess would be that he's trying to manipulate us into doing what it is he really wants us to do. I'm not a wolf. Well, then what are you doing? Well, you seem to be doing a good job, I guess. Now, in order to get past the guards here, you actually do have to read the sign, so that way you can talk to the king about the mission or whatever's going on. Is there anything over here? I don't think there's anything in these rooms, or any one, but I'll double... Oh, there is a guy here. Okay. Ow. Well, I'll keep that in mind with the wolf. Kind of getting Final Fantasy V flashbacks here. Not to mention the music. Kind of sounds like something out of there. Oh, yeah. I don't want to go down here yet. Do that on the way back out. Oh, yeah, sure. No problem. See, there's nothing in that room, but if we go over here... Hey, how's it going? Uh, okay? Alright, I'll... I'll avoid it! I'll, I won't bring it up! I'm not sure why... You get thrown in jail for saying that, but okay. Just when I thought the plot was finally getting serious! Ha <laughs> Huh. Ah. Well, yeah, he's. He is naked! Uh. Yeah, sure.
Oh, cool. What's it? What's going on? How's it going? Nats. Well, I was gonna go after the guy anyway. I like the music here. So I guess that's like Little Red Riding Hood or something? Oh, um, yeah, I'll do the best I can. Oh, hey, all right. Is that the Ark? Let's find out. Okay, well, I think that's almost everything we got here. Oh, right, yeah, I already did that. Some people will say new stuff now that we've got our mission going. Oh. Um, yeah, I suppose someone might have seen the guy. There's nothing in the other rooms on... Or by the throne room there, so don't worry about it. Well, let's see what we got in the basement here. Oh. Um, yeah. Clear as day. Ha uh ha. -huh. They don't even have doors on this prison. How did you even get in there? But all right, okay, we got a mission from the naked king to kill the big bad wolf. Uh, there it is, viewers! <laughs> Oh, right, yeah, I already talked to that one. I thought one of these guys had something to say about the wolf. Oh, yeah, i kind of already been there. Ha ha. Oh, so it's the same wolf, huh, from all those things, huh? I thought they would have had, like, different wolves or something. Hmm, well, they're gone now. So let's see, the, er, ah, I need to talk to her first. I don't know if we have to, but. Yeah, I, I went there, no one's home. Oh, okay. Well, let's see, Gum Forest? Oh, okay. Well, yeah, this town is called Tinkle. And, okay, so yeah, there's Gum Forest. We need to go over there to find the big bad wolf, I guess. I think most of the other houses just say the same stuff. Well, there's the lady who told us about Little Red Riding Hood. Oh, yeah, I'll do the best I can. But before we do that, there's some item synthesis that I want to do. So let's fast forward until I get back to... Where is it? Until I get back to the... Well, I gotta go to the machine world and get to the entrance to the hydro area where we can do more item synthesis. There's a few things that I want to get there. I want to get at least a couple pieces of armor, but I also would like to see if I can't get another intelligence seed. If I can do it, great. If not, then I'll just, well, worry about it later. Then... Don't even bother uh, bringing other party members into the party. It's a quick enough trip. Okay, we're back. And, yeah, I've got four things that I need to make. So, let's see what we got. Okay, so we got the... Where is it? The troll harp there. And, let's see, I need a magical item. So, let's use that. And a liquid. So, where's the antidote? There we are. And we get the ultimate armor in the game. The holy robe. 
almost everyone can equip that, including Reshine. And that'll be really good for her. But for now, I'm just going to give the Holy Robe to Mirianne there because it's the ultimate armor for her too. And yeah, look at that defense you get out of it. Holy cow. Let's see, for the Holy Robe there, as far as other base materials that you could use for it, let me see here. Ah, you could use the Lizard Tail to do that too. Or you could get an Intelligence Seed out of it. But all right, okay, so for the next one, we need the Poison Apple. Where are you? There you are. And I need a solid item. So herbs, that'll get the job done. Oh, it looks like the bottle actually did turn into an empty bottle in my inventory there. Huh, for some reason I thought it just went away. I guess I was wrong. Well, I am wrong on that. Huh. But all right, we get the alkaloid bucket, which if I recall correctly is the ultimate piece of headgear in the game for Lux there. So yeah, look at that defense boost. Okay, so now that we've gotten those, there's a couple of other recipes that we can do here. Let's see, by the way, for the alkaloid bucket, you could also use the dirty magazine or the purple crystal as a base material for that. But otherwise, all you need is, yeah, the base item and what was the other thing? A salad. So let's go with more herbs. And we get, eh. I was hoping I could get another intelligence seed, but let's see what we can do with the dirty magazine. How is that a liquid? It's a magazine. It's paper. No, no, no. I, I don't want to know why it, it's a li This has to be a typo or a, a mistranslation. Maybe it's not actually... A dirty magazine. Maybe it's just like an ordinary magazine that's that's like literally dirty because th they spilled like a coke on it or a, a bottle of water. Yeah, uh, <laughs> this game. Ah, <laughs> oh, nuts. Okay, well we got some other stuff there, but now well, that's all right. But can we defeat the big bad wolf for the King of Tinkle? Find out next time on Let's Play Mystic Arc. This is H.G. Bailey, signing off. Have a good day.